Welcome to PC Mac. Today I'm going to show you how you can install SSL securities on Nextcloud and access your Nextcloud outside from the network with a secure connection. Before starting this video, if you like my work, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Share this video with your family and friends. So let's do it. First of all, I'm using DietPy for this project and we are using CertBoot to install SSL securities on our next cloud. To complete this project, what we need to do is we need to forward the port 80 and port 443 on our router. So let's just go ahead and do that. Let's just log in to our router and forward the ports that is in services and then port forwarding. It will be different for your network your router so please go ahead and do that if you don't know how to do that you can always ask your internet service provider they will do it for you so i have already forwarded the port 80 and port 443 on my router the second thing that you need to do is you require a dynamic dns and i'm using a duck dns server that is right here duckdns.org let me just log in with my Google account and it will take a moment now it's done you can see here on the bottom PC next that's the domain that I'm using and the domain address will be PC next so I already did all the settings on my diet pie so let's just go ahead and log in to duck hit enter and as you can see rejected request from RFC 1918 IP to public server address. So the settings are correct but we need to log into our server from a different network that is outside from our network. Now let me go ahead and show you. Let me take you to my diet pie. Uh, the IP address is 73 as you can see here. Let me log into 192.168.1.73 to show you that we are able to access the default Apache web page or not and then forward slash next cloud that means my next cloud is also working if I'm able to log to in and as you can see I'm logged into my next cloud as well so the ports are forward successfully I have the URL with me PC then I'm able to log into my next cloud server easily you can see that after that what we need to do is we need to go here on our diet pie and we need to open diet pie software so i can show you which plugin you need to install and from here we need to go into software optimized and when we open software optimized we need to go down and look for cert boot and it's right here cert boot free ssl as you can see that you need to navigate to ok and press enter and then you need to install it once you install it will be done okay after that what we need to do is we need to run a command that is die pi let's encrypt once we do that it will take us to this screen where we need to put all the required details that is pcnec.duckdns.org that I've already did that on my duckdns website then the second thing is a valid email address that is support.pcmac.biz I have already entered that then you need to on turn on this particular option that is redirect it will redirect the HTTP connection to HTTPS you can leave HSTS as default and then the key size I recommend you to use 4096 because this one is strong and then you need to go into OK from here and hit enter once you do that you need to just move down to apply and then OK and hit enter then just go to OK it will check your settings if there is something wrong in the setting then we need to press enter to continue and once we done it will just restart the services that are already installed in diet pie and after that everything will be working fine 
so let it be like this in a moment we will be getting the diet by prompt so let's just go ahead and exit from here and okay once we do that you can see that we are on the diet by prompt let's just go ahead and open the google chrome and let's show you i have turned on my recorder on my phone and i'm on the 4g network let's just go ahead and reload the page to check that we are able to access our next cloud or not and as you can see it's on the top right corner that we are on the https that means we are on the secure connection so you can access your next cloud website through with the help of cert boot and you can secure your connection and you can access your website anywhere from the world with on a secure connection so guys that's it from my end if you have any problem regarding this tutorial you can write down in the comment section i'll try to answer you if you like my work please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel share this video with your family and friends thanks for watching bye bye take care have a nice day